Hi, I'm Preston DeGuys. In this video, I'll show you how to create a VMware protection policy for PPDM 19.6, and also how to configure a protection rule that ensures that every time the policy is run, the correct virtual machine resources are added on the spot. Let's start by logging into the PPDM dashboard. If we check assets, we can see there is a list of virtual machines on the vCenter server previously added. Now I'm going to go to protection and add a VMware protection policy, but I'm not going to add any virtual machines manually to that policy. Instead, after I've set up the policy, I'll then set up a protection rule for automated virtual machine inclusion. I'll add a backup configuration for daily backups retained for 14 days, running between 8pm and 6am. Now, since this is a policy for test VMs, I won't worry about SLAs. Because there's only a single data domain on the system, PPDM will automatically select that data domain as the backup target. There will be options here for optimising the backup configuration by capacity or performance, whether I want guest file systems quiesced, and whether I want indexing turned on for the backups. I can just accept the defaults here and click Finish. The protection policy has been added, but it has no virtual machines in it. I'll now create a protection policy rule to automatically select virtual machines for protection when the policy runs. When you create a new protection rule, you start by selecting the protection policy it'll be applied to. Since I only have one protection policy at the moment, that's an easy choice. Here I've created a rule called test underscore VMs that looks for virtual machines with the VM display name that contains the word test. As you can see here, there are six virtual machines in my vCenter environment that match this rule. The protection rule has been added, but it shows zero assets because it hasn't been run yet. The rule gets run each time the policy runs, but I can manually run it by clicking its checkbox and then clicking the Run button. You can see now it's been updated to six assets. When the protection policy runs, it'll automatically back up all six of those virtual machines, unless I've changed which virtual machines have the word test in their name which, of course, is the true power of a protection rule. Thanks for watching, and be sure to check out the blog for more details.